Hello everyone, this is Harlambos Pissuros, Senior Analyst here at IronFX, bringing you the technical updates for the 5th of September. Today I would like to describe again the technical pictures of Euro dollar and gold following uh, Friday's US employment report for August. So let's begin our treatment with the Euro dollar currency pair. Euro dollar spiked higher on Friday after the US employment report showed that non farm payrolls rose by 151k, missing estimates of 180k. However, the pair gave up uh, the gains in the next few hours to hit the 111.50 support barrier. In the absence of any clear trending structure, I would consider the short-term outlook to be flat for now. Taking a look at our short-term oscillators, though, I see signs that the next wave is likely to be positive perhaps for another test near the 112.10 resistance area. The RSI has bottomed slightly below 50 and could enter its uh, bullish territory sometime soon, while the MACD, although negative, shows signs that it could turn up from near its uh, trigger line. As for the broader trend, as long as the pair is trading within the sideways range between 108 and 115, I would maintain my flat stance as far as the longer term trend is uh, concerned. Now let's continue with the precious metal. Gold surged on Friday following the lower than expected non-farm payrolls. The metal broke above the resistance now turned into support hurdle of 1315 and the upper bound of the downside channel that uh, had been containing the price action since the 17th of uh, August. In my view, the rally signaled a short-term trend, trend reversal, and as a result, I would expect the bulls to continue pushing the price higher. I believe that a decisive break above 13.30 is possible to set the stage for extensions towards the next resistance of 13.42, marked by the peak of the 26th of uh, August. Our short-term oscillators detect upside speed and corroborate my view. The RSI emerged above its uh, 50 line, while the MACD already above its trigger line has just uh, turned positive. Switching to the daily chart, I see that the metal is still trading above the uptrend line taken from back at the low of the 17th of uh, December. So, in my view, this keeps the longer-term picture positive. So, that's it for today. For more analysis and charts, please read the full comment on ironfx.com. You can also follow us on Twitter, like us on Facebook, subscribe to our YouTube channel, or circle us on Google Plus to get more trading ideas. This is Haralambos Pissuros. Senior Analyst at IronFX, wishing you solid trading.